Hey, I'm Nick, and we're still talking to Roger Barla about F5's DNS load balancer service, which is an awesome service, uh, has done amazing things over the last year, and Roger started the service last year. But I hear you're handing it over to somebody else, Roger? Yeah, I'm handing it over to Rick Salsa, who's been my product owner for the past few months, so he's got some great experience on it. It's kind of bittersweet to give it uh, over to him, but, you know, like this guitar, if I hand it over to him, maybe he can really refine it. Yeah, I can give it a try. Let go of it. Come on. Jeez, give it up already, Roger. <laughs> Hang on, let me, uh, I'll see what I can, I can do here. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Well, the service is in awesome hands. Rick, glad to hear that you're taking over the service. And Roger, you've done an incredible job on this. Thanks for joining us for those uh, previous segments and your own videos and demos. But I'm sure you are going to be doing some awesome things next too. So keep us updated. Will do. Thanks, guys. Cool. Rick, so what is this LTM thing and why is it so important? LTM is our application delivery controller. It sits in front of your application and protects your apps from bad actors on the internet, but also makes sure that your traffic gets to an available instance every time so that your customers have a great experience. That, that sounds pretty cool, but we're talking about DNS load balancer. So what's the connection between the two? So the connection between the two is we have a new integration out where we can take your LTM and have it send its data up into the cloud to the DNS load balancer so we can make more intelligent traffic steering decisions. How about you show us? Yeah, sure. So let's take a look at this configuration here for a load balancing record that we already have. Here you can kind of see our pool and inside of the pool you can see that there are multiple existing IP endpoints. But if you'll notice, each one of them has a health monitor on them. Well, these health monitors are configured to run every 30 seconds, and essentially they're reaching out to your IP endpoints, to your app, and checking to see if they're still available. What makes the LTM integration so great is that the big IP actually sends that data to us. And in addition to just knowing whether or not the application instance on your big IP is up, we have more intelligent information from the big IP itself in terms of knowing how many connections it might be seeing at the moment, which allows us to make more intelligent decisions like steering users away from a busy big IP device to a device that might have fewer connections. Oh, well, that's awesome. So it optimizes the traffic flow, but also removes all of this unnecessary overhead doing health checks, right? That's right. As you can see, now that we've added it to our configuration, the status is available in the dashboard immediately. That's awesome. Well, Rick, uh, I appreciate you taking the time. When is the service available? It's available right now. You can go to f5.com slash preview and sign up for our early access and provide our team with some valuable feedback. Thanks, Rick. Talk to you later. See ya.